This company is Inspiro Trading. It's a manual coffee grinder, and here it is. Now, I have two other manual coffee grinders, and this one is so much easier than them. The other ones take so much work. I mean, I love them, but they take so much work. This one is so easy. Can you come here and just lean up and do a do a sample? Sample of what? Just and turn and show them how easy it is. This is on fine grind. Already it's like filled the bottom. But you could see it is so easy. That's fine grind. My other one, you would be both of them, you would be grinding for like ten minutes and you'd look and you'd get a little bit of powder. And the one thing I hate about the one is that right here it's got this giant spike. <laughs> yes. So you go by and next thing you know, you slit your wrist. Yeah. <laughs> it's terrible. So that's good enough. So you can see in there, that was just a couple of turns and so easy. The thing he's talking about is I have another one and right here, instead of this just being a plain screw, it has a spike. So as you're turning, it catches you right on your wrist all the time. And the end isn't like it's rounded or anything, it's sharp. Oh, yes, it is a serious point. Someone breaks into your house, put the shotgun away and just pick that thing up. Yep, we can just go after them with our coffee grinder with the spike. I mean, it looks pretty, but it's, it just hurts. Yeah. So, definitely, if you want a manual coffee grinder, this is the one. Because we have two other models. And I don't want to disrespect the other models and show you them. Because they do work. Just not as good. Just not as good. And so, when I first saw this one, I didn't like it because I didn't like this. It's just a little rubber lid that goes on. I was like, what the heck is this? You know, I'm so used to the stainless steel ones that I have. And so at first view of this, I was like, this, I'm never gonna use this. But it's so easy. And I used to sit in front of the TV with my other one for about 30 minutes to get enough, I'd say about a half a cup of coffee grinds. A no lie, a half an hour. Actually, my son would work on, he would use one and I would use the other. And we would sit there and grind coffee just for a one-time use. So this, definitely, the Inspiro Trading Company. Uh, I am so glad that I found you. Oh, it came with, it comes with like, it looks like a paintbrush. But it is a brush to clean the insides. I don't think it's in here. Let me, let me look. We'll let him look. I can't remember. I think I put it in my doodicky draw. Oh, inside is if you want to and you grind up coffee, this is a cap so you can keep it fresh in here if you want. Usually I grind exactly what we need and then use it right then. But if you were to grind more, <clears throat> this is to seal it so that it doesn't go stale on you. And then again, it does come with, it looks just like a paintbrush. Um, it's in my gadget drawer. It looks exactly like a paintbrush. Yeah, and it's for cleaning the mechanism down here. You see that? That's a ceramic grinder. And so the brush is just for cleaning this. Uh, it has a wooden handle. I'm sorry, I'm lazy. I don't want to go and get it. But it looks just like a paintbrush with a white handle, a wooden handle and uh, like a bamboo brush. But definitely, I cannot explain to you why it is I don't want a electric coffee grinder. My brain just feels like this is the right thing to do. I don't know why. But what if there's no electricity and you wanna make coffee? You can still make coffee over a fire or something. Now you don't have to worry about it because you have a manual coffee grinder. I have never owned a electric coffee grinder. I don't know why. Nerd. Nerd. Actually, one time I ground coffee in my bullet and it scratched the whole inside of my bullet mug. That was the only time I used it. One time only. Um, I just like the manual better. And I am definitely just going to put the other ones up for sale because they're brand new. But uh, I'll never use them again because this is so easy. The other ones, my wrist hurt. Uh, we would get stabbed by the point on the one thing. 
uh, he didn't want to use that one, I didn't want to use that one, so we'd be like, I'll take this one, and whoever got stuck with a pointy one, whoa, oh, 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 oh. The thing about the pointy one is it also takes forever to... Oh, God. Find. Really, no lie. Maybe 30 minutes watching TV, and I'd look, and I'd be like, oh, no. There's not even that much done. So, anyway, blah, blah, blah. I talk too much, as usual. So, check this out. Decent price and a fabulous, fabulous product. Great product.